one a particle moves along a straight line and passes through a fixed point o with an initial velocity of this one okay initial velocity so we know that when t is equal to 0 v is equal to 10 meter per second the acceleration at t second after passing point o is given by so we have the this equation a is equal to 40 minus 8 Find the instantaneous velocity of particle at the fourth second. So here we know that. So from S, V, A, right? So here we know that going from left to right, it is differentiation. This one is TS over DT, DV over DT. And going the other way around is integration. So we see here it's given A and we wanted to find what is our V. So A to V. So, to find V, we must do integration of A. V is equal to integration of A. So, here, integration A is equal to 4 T minus 8. So, we know that this one is in term of T. So, this one is DT. Which is equal to, so when you integrate this one, what happens is that we add the power to 1 and then divide with power. So, here, 4, we just put the constant and then for T, T is actually power of 1 and then we add power 1 so it's become 2 and then we divide with power. So this one is negative 8, negative 8 become negative 8 T. So this one we see here this one is indefinite, we don't have range so this one is plus C. So here we have 2 T square minus 8 T plus C. Okay. But don't forget we have this one when T is equal to 0, V is equal to 10. So if we substitute T and V, we can get our equation. So just now, just write V is equal to 2T square minus 8T plus C. So when V is equal to, when T is equal to 0, V is equal to 10. So this one is 10 when T is equal to 0. So this one C is equal to 10, right? So here we have the equation of V, V is equal to 2T square minus 8 plus 10. So we see here instantaneous velocity when at the fourth second. So when we have the equation, we can calculate. So when t is equal to 4, v is equal to 2, 4 square minus 8, 4 plus 10. So this one is 2 times 16 minus 32 plus 10, right? 18 times 4 is 32. So this one is 32 minus 32 is 0 plus 10 is 10. So 10, this one is the velocity we are talking about. It is meter per second so be minimum velocity of the particle so we know that this one you see a quadratic graph right so we know that a is gradient of v so for example this one is a smiling graph right because we see here this one is positive so here when we have the velocity function graph we know that going down here this one v this one sorry a is smaller than zero and here going up a is larger than zero and there is this point here the minimum point where a is equal to zero so the minimum velocity is when a is equal to zero so why is this equal to zero because this one is like the changing point be between the smaller to become larger it must be zero in between so this one where we know that here when a is equal to zero 40 minus 8 is equal to zero 4 t is equal to 8, t is equal to 8 divided by 4. So here we get 2. So time is 2. The question wanted you to find velocity. So when t is equal to 2, v is equal to 2, 2 square minus 8, 2 plus 10. So 2 times 4 minus 16 plus 10. 8 minus 16 is negative 8 plus 10. Here we get 2. This one is meter per second.